Welcome. In front of me I have a Xiaomi Mi Band 2 and I want to actually go over a couple changes that have been made to the app that you can use with the band itself. So I'm gonna start off by actually opening up the app which is called Mi Fit. And from here, assuming you're already connected, you can go into the profile alongside with having this completely new added. Uh, you can actually have like walk, run, cycling. You can quickly access it to just tap on go and it will start scanning or well, monitoring it. So it's a nice thing. Can I not do it? Um, just gonna stop it. Okay. So apart from this nice touch up that you have a quick access to these functions, you can go also into the profile and select your band right here. And here you can enable notifications for incoming calls, alarm apps, uh, idle alerts, and you can also tap on more and see basically the entire list of things that you can be notified on on the band. And you can switch them off whichever one you like to see. Uh, on top of that, you can change, uh, for instance, uh, display settings right here, which will change whatever it, what is showing right here. By default, you have only like three things showing, three different tiles, which I'm not sure, but I, I think those are the default ones that you have uh, time, distance, and uh, heart rate. But you can freely add other ones that are shown here by checking them off and confirming with OK. And then if you try to do this again, you should see now calories, also heart rate and battery. Basically the ones that I have added. So that's an option there. Um, apart from that, you have a lousy Find My Band, which um, if you have misplaced it in your house and you have sonic hearing, then I guess that would be useful. Other way, if it's under a pile of, let's say, clothing, yeah, I don't believe you have any chance of finding it with this function. I'm not even sure if you can hear that on the camera, that it's basically just a buzzing noise. Yeah, I don't, I don't even see that the camera is picking it up. Wait, maybe I can bring it up to the here. That, that's basically what you get. So. That is the Find My Band. Um, apart from this, um, going back actually to to the notifications, um, for them to actually work uh, all the time, you can go here to run in the background and you get a little guide on how to make it run in the background because certain phones to preserve battery, they have a way of, uh, of basically shutting off a background applications so for instance if this would be running on this app in the background my phone would probably just disable it after a certain amount of time and then I would, wouldn't be getting any more notifications so you get a little guide on how to do it um, so yeah now going back you get a couple other informations here like Bluetooth address firmware version uh, reset to f uh, factory settings uh, if you actually choose that the the band will disconnect it will forget the band itself so it's basically as useful as tapping on unpair um what is else um heart rate sleep assistance uh, i just I, I don't find use for it really apart from a novelty just to see how stressed i am while sleeping but hey i don't know what else other people might use it for so it's a it's an option then you get something like uh, what uh, wrist you're wearing it on. Um, so where was it? Uh, band, band location right here. So you can change if your band uh, is on the right arm or wrist or, or left one. Um, what else? Um, then you have also option to lift wrist to view info. So if I check this on, let's see if I can actually like imitate it yeah i don't think i have enough of swing here to to show it but basically if you have it on your wrist you can lift up your wrist and uh, up to your face and it should wake up the display 
And you also have a, a wrist flick, which would be kind of like this to switch an up, uh, switch the uh, tile in a way. So instead of tapping it, you can just kind of flick your wrist and switch it. So that's also an option. It's right here. Rotate wrist to switch info. So you just check it on and it would work like that. And that is about it from all the more useful, I guess, information and changes that you can do to your band. Now, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and thanks for watching.